Good morning guys, happy Friday. Not only is it Friday, it's Friday the 13th. Something weird happened in the night. I don't know if it has to do with, the, with Friday the 13th, but something creepy has happened. Something super creepy, right Gabby? What? So I made breakfast, got all dressed, and I came into the dining room this morning, and this happened. All the schleich is back on the dining room table. Do you know anything about that, Missy? Do you know anything about that, Missy? Was it you? Probably. Ooh. Something scary. I don't know. I think it's a Friday the 13th thing. A freaky Friday. Freaky Friday. Anyway, good morning, guys. Obviously, uh, the Schleich stuff is down here again because the girls can't play with it upstairs. It's just not as um, accessible to them, and they've been missing it. Somebody especially has been missing. Who's been missing it? Me. Yeah, Sophia's been missing it. It's the last day for our lease horses. It's the last day for our lease horses. Lease. <laughs> the last day for our lease horses is super sad. I'm okay with it though because I know we're gonna get the opportunity to lease again and still we're looking for a horse. I found one. It seems kind of like it might work. I'm still looking into it a little bit more. And when I figure out if it's a good fit for us, I'll show you guys because I like listening to your guys' opinions. Anyway, I think I should take this opportunity uh, while I'm thinking of it to explain our situation a little bit more. I know a lot of you guys are concerned about the prospect of us buying a horse, so I thought I would explain. Okay. So when we buy a horse, it will literally be exactly like buying a lease horse, except for we'll pay for it. Um, basically what's gonna happen is that at our barn and where we live, we, do, we have zero opportunity to learn how to own horses and how to have a horse farm with zero opportunities unless we already have a horse. Basically, uh, our barn doesn't really have lease horses. Um, we got to lease these horses while our owner was away because they weren't being used, but they are school horses, so they are working all the time. Over Christmas, we'll get to lease them again while she's away. What are you doing in my shirt, no, Missy? My fault. What are you doing in my it's shirt? My fault. What are you doing in my shirt? It's my fault. So uh, when we buy a horse, it's not like we're gonna just say, hey, we have a horse, let's do whatever we want. We're gonna be learning. It'll be exactly like a lease horse. Our coach will take over charge of it. She will be uh, showing us how to feed it, but she will be in charge of feeding it. We will not be. Anything that comes up, she will be in charge of it and she will teach us about it so that we can learn. It's the only opportunity we have to learn. Um, I know a lot of you guys did it completely different. A lot of you guys grew up, um, taking care of horses and leasing horses and spent your whole life doing that kind of stuff. But we are way older than that. Like we are way past that stage. We need to, if we're gonna own a horse, we need well, to do it now while we can. There's black hair on my head. Don't tell them I have a black hair on me, oh my gosh. She has a black hair on my head. <laughs> Let's go get a tweezers. Anyway, uh, so yeah, like, I understand where you guys are coming from. Just know that there are so many different ways to learn about horses. So uh, buying a horse and keeping it at our barn is the best case scenario for us. Even our coach is on board with this. She agrees. We're just getting ready to go uh, for a walk with our puppies before we head down. Ooh, before we head down to the barn, just stepping on my puppies. Anyway, I wanted to show you guys something. I don't know. This is like a family channel, so I don't know if this is too much information. But we're all girls here, right? Mostly. Anyway, we always have these problems when we go in the car. My kids have bathroom problems. So they, he does. they don't go to the bathroom before we leave. So we'll get like down the road a few miles and they have to pee, which is fine. But when we're on long road it's trips, so they have to pee all the time. And so Sam went ahead and ordered this. Like so basically, you just stick it to you. You can even be sitting. You can even lay down and you just stick this thing to you and you pee and it makes you like you're a boy. You can pee in a bottle if you're in the car or you can, yeah, he's all, Sophie's all embarrassed. She's like, what are you doing showing them that? <laughs> yeah, so we already tried it. Gabby, it did not work for her. She's like, I'm not doing this. Did, you, did it work for you? Yeah, super cool. Anyway, Sam ordered three of them. I don't know how well they're gonna work, but yeah, I mean, it's worth a try, right? I know if the girls were little, it would definitely have been a lifesaver, but it's gonna be fun to try. Rigged by Ruby. Gabby, you have to hold on to her and say no. Yes, do you want me to walk her? Don't let 
better do that. Heel. Ruby. Heel. You better behave. Heel. <laughs> Are you okay, Gabby? Yes. <laughs> she hurt her arm crack a few times. She bolted. Heel. <laughs> But good it's that you have squirrel. It's good that you held on. This girl it needs to learn to walk on a leash. I love when we come around the corner and they're all looking. Is that blue down there or smoky? I can see him in the camera. That's He's smoky. Smoky, hi. That's Journey. That one with that hi, Journey. white on his legs. That one right there. That one. Is Journey the one that might be pregnant? No, Journey, that's Hope. She might be hope. Pregnant. Let's hope that there's a baby in that belly. What do you guys think? Wiser, my personal favorite. And that's wiser. And the horse that I'm looking at right now for us looks like that. Oh, I see Clearly, we're at the horse and barn. I see Jasmine and staring at us. You see Jasmine staring? Oh, I see Jasmine staring at us too. See that She's white like, stripe? oh, I better get out of here. The white stripe through. The tree. Yeah, I see a white striped nose. You guys can see it. Wait, I'll stop. Right there. See that white stripe right there? Oh, it's backing up. Is she heel, backing up? Heel boy, heel. heel. This kitten heel. heels heel. better than Ruby. She walked all the way down here with us, or he walked all the way down here with us. Heel. Heel. Come on, Jasmine's like, hey, I actually want to ride today. That's cool. You guys said don't bring umbrellas to the barn, so I listened. I mean, it's not raining today, but whew, I won't be doing that anymore. I feel like she's like a moody horse, man. I know it's I a know mare what thing. Some people do, Mom. But I've just noticed it since <clears throat> we've been leasing her that she's like kind of grouchy. <clears throat> some people, when your horse is right here and you can't get it to move, they just slip the halter on like that. Yeah, but... go ahead. Really? Yeah, that's what Fiona does. Yeah. And with, is there a reason we shouldn't be doing that? Wiser, um, she could just take his lead rope, clip it around so it's like a circle. Hey, there's and blue. I know. It's smoky. They're all here to say hello this morning or today. Hi, Blue. Blue is a happy boy. I've really gotten to really like Blue. He's like, do you have treats? I got no treats. Nothing. I'm sorry about your luck. He's like, really? You want me to ride with you all for nothing? Yeah. He's a happy boy. Well, that was pretty smooth. Just like that, we got Jasmine. Jasmine just was like, all right, fine. I'm coming today. So hopefully that means that she's in a good mood. And now uh, Gabby is getting... Blue all, all haltered up. I really like Lola. I think she's a really pretty horse. I think she bucks though. I think I read it on the website I saw her listed for sale on. But isn't she a pretty little thing? Comment below if you think Lola would be a cute little horse for us. I, obviously she's not good for us or else Fiona would recommend it. There was a time when I was lonely I was trying hard to get by, taking day by day But baby, then you came along I know I never felt that strong Nothing's gonna hold us down Yeah, we are taking off the ground now Stay with me, we're right My plan while Fiona was away was to learn how to saddle a horse And yeah, it's like easy for me now last day with our lease horses at the barn we'll get an opportunity probably to lease them again when it's like Christmas time and I'll see what other options we have maybe we'll be able to lease some other horse or who knows what will happen while we're still on our search for a perfect horse anyway I learned a couple of things and the most important thing I learned is I definitely want a gelding definitely are you guys playing follow the leader
got me feeling You got me feeling alright Whenever I'm around you, baby Some of you guys have asked about the pool noodles and how that could spook a horse. Pool noodles are in this barn already because they are for desensitization. So horses are already desensitized to them. And same with the little pool with the water bottles in the middle over there. Also for desensitization. All right, we're changing around horses. That's what happens when you ride with friends. Gabby's very first time riding Western. Gosh, it's long. Do you need to size them? Don't know. They're probably just fine. I love when they try other horses, try other other things. Gabby's never been really big on Western because she's never really tried it, so she's getting an opportunity to try it. Come on, it's gotta be more comfortable. There goes Sophie on Western. Yeah, you can ride without stirrups. Body. Take Jazzy, f or take. Just take him for a walk. You don't have to it's like trying out different horses. What kind of breed is Azzy? Oh, what breed is Azzy? Oh, well. A Welsh pony. But I'm not gonna fall too deep. successful bridal wrap. It might not look pretty, but I did it all myself. I am learning. I learned I know how to tack up comfortably now. I like, it doesn't even feel stressful to me. I learned how to bridal wrap. Doesn't even feel stressful to me. When I have like my coach leaning over my shoulder watching me, I feel all nervous and my adrenaline gets going and then I can't even take anything in. But when I'm just here casually doing my own thing, I can pick it up. Like, I feel so good. All right, so we just cooled down the horses and now we're gonna take them down to the barn and we're actually gonna get to give them supper today. And then we'll wait for them. And we're gonna go with one of our friends is here riding. So she's gonna come with us. There we are, last time. Last time as a lease horse. Say bye, Jasmine. Go, go, go. Oh. Go, she sees my treats. Daddy, mom, can I have her, mom? Keep a far distance. Yeah, keep a far distance away. Keep going. We are walking. We are doing a, our last bareback ride for a while. We got Miss <clears throat> Molly coming behind us too. Molly, you should lead the way. <laughs> We're actually gonna get to feed the horses. We have all the instructions. 
Then we're gonna wait for them to eat and then put them back in the paddocks for the night. A perfect end to a perfect lease season. I cannot wait to see what happens next. He's spooked. No, he's spooked over the set. Uh-oh. Can you turn on the lights, Mom? Yeah. They're in the fever. Okay. I'm coming by you, Blue. I'm coming by. You can see behind him, It's okay. It's okay. Hi, Smokey. You having supper? There you go, Blue. Blue was freaking out a bit because he's afraid of the dark. I lost Sophie. Co Sophie, come on in. Uh-oh. There we go. There's Jasmine. There's your supper, girly. They're excited to get their supper. Wait, Sam, can you close the door a bit, please? Yeah, wait a minute there, Jasmine. Blue, I want to kiss you goodbye. She wants to kiss you goodbye. goodbye. Say, you've been a really good lease horse. We have to put them back outside, eh? Oh, we do? Yeah. Close them up there. You have to put them back outside? Yeah, yeah. that's what she said. Okay. His, he decorated his stall for Halloween. He did. Friday the 13th, you guys, he uh, decorated his stall with That's kinda creepy. cobwebs. Hi, Zig. Kinda creepy. Say hi to everybody, hi, Ziggy. Hi, boy. Oh, my All right, Mr. Ziggy. Uh-oh. No carrot for you. Because I've been missing you. Look at it. It's so weird, it's so crazy. I haven't seen him in like a long time. And just seeing him, I feel the connection. Like, I. Not because he's pretty, even though he is pretty, but he literally makes me feel something. So amazing, you're such an amazing boy. You having your supper? In there with all the spiders? He's a, he just decorated his, all of the horses here have decorated their stuff. You can tell Fiona's away, huh? Blue and, uh, and Jasmine, this is the last hurrah for now. Are you sad, are you sad? Yeah, for sure at Christmas we'll get them again. Yeah. Okay. We are headed home for supper is already 5.30. Our <coughs> leasing is done for this for this time. We're leasing in Christmas break. Yeah, but we'll see. Who knows what's gonna happen? La, la, la. <laughs> Alright you guys, we're gonna end today's video. We're gonna do question of the day and really question of the day comes from Standard Equestrian. I got my phone here and she says I love your vlogs and would love if you could sub to my channel. She said, maybe this can be question of the day. Well, yeah, it is question of the day. She wants to know, are you guys going to the Royal Winter Fair this year? Are we going to the Royal Winter Fair? Yes! Yes! <laughs> yes. Sophie, are we going to the Royal Winter Fair? Yes! We are going to the Royal Winter Fair this year. We go almost every year and it's so much fun. I can hardly wait. And I have a feeling we're gonna see some of you guys there. Do you think we'll see you guys, those guys there? Maybe. We might wear our t-shirts that say day by day vlogs on them just in case you guys don't recognize us and you have to look at our shirts to see if it's really us. Um, every subscriber is watching it. Hopefully you come to Royal Winter Fair. Oh, careful. <laughs> right. Don't forget to subscribe to this video and give it a thumbs up. See you later. See you later. Bye. Bye. Don't forget.
to make sure to hit that subscribe button down below.